Hi guys, Rachel here and today I'm going to be showing you how to get really beautiful copper eyes using our Loose Mineral Eyeshadows and our Loose Mineral Blush in the shade Peach King. Let's get started on our skin. As per usual, I'm going to go in with my Certified Organic Enriched Rose Oil and apply it to the high points of my face as a natural highlighter. So I'm going to take some on the back of our hand, lightly, and just apply using the fingers just to the tops of the cheekbones, tip of the nose, cupid's bow and then on the other cheekbone as well and just lightly patting into the skin. Alright, now taking your gift, which is your vegan kabuki brush, we're going to be applying our certified organic BB cream. As you can see, this is taking me no time at all to do and the BB cream is just melting into the skin with this beautiful kabuki. Thanks to the synthetic bristles, it means that I can apply either liquid or powder products with this brush and it's all in one, so I can do my whole base with it. So just lightly applying the rest of our foundation. Taking your kabuki again, you're just going to wipe off any excess BB you may have left on there. And we're going to be using it to apply our baked mineral bronzer. So just taking that brush, and we're only just going to use the outer edge to apply our bronzer. So just taking a bit on the brush, dust off any excess, and I'm only applying to the base of the cheekbone and up towards the temples. We don't want to put it all over our face. So just lightly applying that colour. All right, now taking your essential blush, your loose mineral blush in Peachy Keen, we're gonna be applying this to the cheeks using our Kabuki brush again. This literally can do all of our makeup in one. So tapping the tiniest bit into the lid, this color is super pigmented. We're just gonna take our Kabuki again, dip it lightly in the powder, brush off any excess, and lightly apply just to the apples of the cheeks. For our eyes, we're going to be taking our Peachy Keen blush again and we're going to be using it as our base shade. To apply, we're going to be using our fluffy blending brush. So tapping a tiny bit into the lid, we're going to take this colour over the lid, up on the crease and then under the eye as well. So I'm just going to lightly apply that one. Just use back and forth windscreen wiper motions to really set that colour. Taking your Copper Crush eyeshadow and a flat eyeshadow brush, we're going to be applying this copper shade to the outer corners of the lid and under the eye. So tapping a tiny bit into the lid, that's way too much. So taking a tiny bit of that copper shade, we're applying to the outer corners of the eye. your eyeshadow brush and just dust off any excess of that copper crush eyeshadow. We're going to be using our peach fetish eyeshadow as the shade for the middle to the inner corner of the lid. So just having a tiny bit in the lid there and applying from the center of the lid in towards the corner of the eye. Now using your finger just blend those two shimmer shades together. Now taking your Anika Vegan Mineral Mascara, we're going to finish the eye look. To finish our base, we're going to be using our Peach Fetish Eyeshadow again as a highlighter and this will create the most beautiful glow. And we're going to be using our Anika Vegan Fan Brush to apply it so that it doesn't go too heavy. So, tapping a tiny bit into the lid again. We're going to be applying to the tip of the nose, the cupid's bow and the top of the cheekbones. So to finish the look, we're going to be using our Sheer Peach Certified Organic Vegan Lipstick and this is a beautiful shimmer peach shade to tie our look all together. So just taking a little bit of that on the lens. So this is the finished look. I hope you liked it. If you did, please let us know below. Otherwise, I'll see you next time for our next look. Bye guys.